What's going on guys? This is Mass and welcome back to some more Smite Conquest. Today we're playing some Arachne in this solo lane. I'm gonna see if we can get away with just going gooseberries on the Arachne solo. By the way, this might get trolled. Is it fine? Yeah, I might get a little scuffed here. Hopefully Hera can kind of bring them all together and it works out and then I can come tank that in a sec. This actually is really clean. Wait, that works so well. I don't know if it actually works well or if it's just because Hera clears dumb and she actually lined it up all nice. Yeah, Hera's got, I think her one, doesn't her one do like 100 plus damage early game? Like, isn't it ridiculous? You're getting arachne on? She did kill the spiders, but we did do some absolutely stupid damage and this thing is lasting forever right now. Give me another. Give me another. Nice, good to start. So we're going to try and go no golden blade, which I don't think I've done, Um, at least outside of the jungle. Wait, are you dead? Because spiders tank. Yeah, can't be sleeping on the arachne early game when it comes to anything that's not clear related. Because our PvP damage is really good. We just have the giant downside of our wave clear is actually non-existent right now. Um, I don't know, spiders do things. If she doesn't kill them, what do you do? Yeah, that sucks. That's <laughs> that's so bad. I got it's almost got a minion down. They exclusively hit one minion and it's almost dead. Can we proc this on totem? I couldn't remember. I probably shouldn't have. Wait, we can, okay, we can proc it, but they don't hit it. Nice. That's a hell of a combo, high res. So, yeah, hopefully we can get plenty of minion kills. It's a little extra hard to get the gooseberries online because we need the actual last hits to get gooseberries for the um the first stage. The other part's easy. Let's see, is she actually going to make sure to hit those? Oh, well, she left one. Uh-oh. We're playing her acne. So, a spider. Come on. Dude, I think if she didn't kill the one, I actually, that might have been a kill. Yeah, poor Mulan, man. Especially being Mulan, it's got to feel so wrong to be getting bullied early game right now. If she plays it just a little bit different, if she doesn't path aggr aggressively to begin with, so I never get to go on her right away, and she just plays around the minions, then she should be winning this pretty hard. That's literally all there is to it. Because Arachne is just so bad at dealing with minions early on. And then eventually we get to try and do gooseberry things. Come on, please give last hits. I almost, I feel like I almost care more about getting these last hits right now than I do about actually killing her. All right, I don't, yeah, I thought that might be coming up. I don't want to be getting pulled into tower if I can avoid it. Also, you're dead. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not quite dead. It was, it was close. It was close. If she pushed up just a little bit farther, I think we could have gone for it. Or maybe if we had the shard. But I would like to not be dying to tower, you know? All right. I don't think we get to invade that blue buff because I don't know where the jungler's at and I'm scared. Do spiders last hitting give me last hit? I don't think they do since they're pets, right? I would assume... See, should I just go straight to it? I want to greed this. Nice, I think we got plenty of time. Kazuku's on the way, so I want to make sure I get farm. But, looks like we got plenty of time. So yeah, we're going to go Amplifier, and then from there, I, I honestly don't know entirely how we're going to build this. Like, I kind of feel like it could be fun to do some Death Embrace stuff late game. Maybe we'll build it hybrid, man. I really don't know. I mostly just wanted to mess around with Gooseberries. <laughs> it's, it's really most of what there is to it. It's been a while since we played Arachne, since the rework. Um, I feel like it's kind of bland to play her in the jungle. Like, she just has a cheesy thing that she's very good at. She just feels, I don't know, just kind of more OP and boring in the jungle. Whereas in the solo lane, she has some massive glaring flaws that makes it spicier to play her, you know? I do that a lot. I wonder how many people can't relate to that at all. Where I actually have fun making it intentionally harder, um, <laughs> to some degree. Like, obviously trying to play well, but not necessarily, you know, playing gods in a different role where they're kind of bad. And then because they're kind of bad, you got to play them different. And you don't just do the specific thing that they're really good at. Makes it more fun. Okay, I think, I don't know if it works this way. We maybe get the, the Gooseberry T2 in a sec here. I need to back really bad if I can find the chance. I got to be a little careful not not to fight if I can avoid it, I think. Here, have have a web. I don't know, be distracted. I got to see, I got to see if Totem gives stank. For science. Don't worry, champ. Hi, Rez, are you kidding me? That's fine. It is kind of its own thing. It makes sense. I honestly just couldn't remember. All right. I think we have to straight up stick around this one last wave. If I get real desperate, I will straight up ult it for wave clear. Because our clear is still non-existent. Damn, she's so afraid. Well, okay. I might have spoken too soon. Yeah, like, I'm honestly not remotely trying to fight her right here. She should be trying to fight me because I don't have the item. 
All right, let's go get an entire vital amplifier and then more. But I don't know what the more is going to be. So I think we're just going to work on this because it works. Because it's because it's something. Yeah, I don't know. I, I want some damage, right? I want at least some damage in this build. So we got to go like XE amplifier, maybe eventually a kin size. But maybe it'd be good to go berserkers and shoguns. I don't know, man. I really don't. And maybe we'll just go crit. At the moment, um, the arrow is so insanely OP that it feels wrong to go crit and not build arrow, but Death Toll is just way better early game. Where did Mulan get to? You just doing blue buff? I think so. I think I heard her. I gotta make sure to smack her soon. We're gonna have to commit super hard so I can actually get the gooseberries finished up and then have wave clear. This is the massive downside of the pick is if things don't go well for us early on, even though we only have one kill, um... You got, you got a decent amount of time where you don't have the gooseberries. So, like, eventually they're online and that should be all the clear that we need, but... Like, right now, if she fights around the wave, we're in so much trouble. <laughs> that wiggle's so troll. Oh, I didn't get the last auto off. I was hoping... If, if she panic ulted there, we straight up get up. By the way, we finished gooseberries off that. If she panic ulted... <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I thought this was so aggressive. I thought it was really funny. Um, yeah, if she panicled, then we should have been able to kill her there. We still came relatively close anyways. But what matters is I got gooseberries done. That's what really matters. Okay, do you hatch spiders and they hit you? They hit you. Okay, this game's weird. I feel like this should effectively be the same exact thing as Totem, right? God, that was, that was a dirty little greedy juke right there. That's just sick. All right, step up. Step up. Come on. You know you want to. Step up. Oh, I didn't think that'd be up yet, honestly. All right, I should actually be way more careful. We do have wards. Let's go plays them. I might just die to gank. Oh, was that you that popped a pot? Getting scared. I think it was her that popped a pot. I thought Rat was here. Wait, you're dead. Why did you do that? Is this setting up for a gank? I don't, I don't know why she did that. <laughs> I feel like she's known better for a while now and just randomly did that right there. Yeah, get these wards up here. Whenever our ult's down, especially, we're definitely super vulnerable to the, um... It is rat jungle, right? Yeah, to the rat gank. But based on Hera's, Hera's rage, I'm assuming he's been pretty busy over in mid so far. Speaking of which, he's ganking mid. Terror Rage incoming. Here we go. Yep. And then we get a little... Come on. <laughs> champ. I might have overdone it with the champ. That might be that might be a tilter. That might be a tilter. I might have overdone it. <laughs> I like to poke the bear too much, man. I like to I like to do it way too much. Like it's so funny. It's not it's not even like relevant to me. It's just happening and I just think it's too funny. Alright. What are we doing, Mulan? Have we learned our lesson? Apparently, because she's just straight up running all the way back to tower and banking. So I think she might have learned the lesson. How big is the farm lead right now? If I can read. Oh my god, it's massive. I have 2k gold on her? Yikes. How? How is it that much? By the way, this guy greeted into brawlers. I think with the idea of nerfing my healing? If it's just rat, we maybe kill him. I need my one, though. Aw, oh, too bad. Don't eat it! Okay, well, he didn't quite eat it. It was close. We died a rat ult. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. That was dumb. If I, uh, if I got the combo on him right there. Nice. They clean up. Good stuff, guys. Oh, and that's just a dead Atlas. No way he's getting away with that. Wait, kill Mula. Oh. Nice. Good stuff. That's fine. I'm okay with dying like that. Yeah, I got a little too greedy. We didn't quite get the stun on Rat. It was super close. And then when I turned at the end. <laughs> what is she mad about now, man? You just got to clean up. 
You're not happy with it? All right, let's go a little bit of defense. Because they might actually start doing dirty things to me, as they should be. So maybe, maybe we'll squeeze in a little defense late, even though I probably should have gone right away with it. Sick of this jungle for real. If any boomers needed the translation, by the way. That's what FR stands for. It does not stand for France. Don't worry, I got you, I got you. Fellow Zoomer Mast is here to explain everything. See, I'm almost a millennial, so I can relate, but I actually know absolutely every reference. <laughs> oh my god, it's so sassy, man. This team, this team might be, uh, this team might be for me. That's so funny. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Look at her. Look at the ego she has gained just like that. All right, you're dead. Oh, she wouldn't have been dead anyways. We didn't have the one. What the? Excuse me, ma'am. The hell? Am I getting ganked or what? I don't know why she's being so aggro right there. She steps back up. God, I need a health chalice, man. Oh no. Oh no. The amount of the amount of back and forth on this team right now. What's happening? Guys! We can all get along, right? I love my I love my smite games with a little bit of a little bit of spice and chat. Bro, I am trying to clear a wave here! Start dying. Uh-uh. No, be dead. I missed. We had the one on that auto. If I hit it, she died. Thanks. Did she die? I mean, I would I would have had to commit, but I think she would have died. Wait, you're so greedy, man. What? Why would you do this? I feel like he's almost playing it so clean, and then he randomly ends. Is <laughs> I feel like how it's going. Speaking of randomly in, we might be dying to gank right here. I'm okay with it. I need a little... Yeah. Let's try and stall a little bit so I can get my beads. Okay, Rat did get a little farmed, and then that was not the play. Well done. <laughs> nice. I played that really clean. We stalled just long enough to get beads and just straight up killed him. Obviously, as you guys can tell by him dying. Ooh. I smell it. I can smell it, Arachne. Oh, that's a big VGS. That's a big VGS. <laughs> Die bother with shoguns. Like, we're just gonna keep building from here. Let's go, like, Kinsize or something. And then we'll get a little blink. Hit him with the immediate you're welcome for the missing right call as Mulan shows up in mid. Oh. We make the call while sassing in advance. It's too clean. It is too clean. Call me Juggin Sup. Is that really. I don't know if that's what I would name change to, man. Doesn't really roll off the tongue. It's me, Juggin' Sup. Actually, you know what? It kind of does. It's actually got a bit of a ring to it. Excuse me, sir. I am trying to do totem here. Hey! Wait, stop. Wait a minute, stop. Wait. <laughs> no, you're kidding. Okay. Oh. I am playing Arachne right now. What? I am, in fact, playing Arachne right now. I think we maybe should have had the rat ganks happen a little earlier in the land. Yeah, you know what? So, um, gotten to feel out Berserkers a little bit right there. And yeah, if we went Berserkers second item, I think we straight up don't die to the one gank. And we're maybe like 7 slash 8 no instead, by the way. I, I a little bit, like in a way I'm build diffing now. I can just go pick up my own. But I also build diff myself a little bit. Where if we if we built a better order here and we got the defense online sooner, I'm assuming we could have done like the same things because we get enough attack speed out of it while being way tankier. Because oh my god, they get so farmed right now. And I did like I played it well, but I honestly think at this point it really seems like just straight up having berserkers. We're just kind of chilling one v two. Although we do need ult. If I don't have ult and things go like at all wrong at any point and I just get CC chained, then I don't think we get to do anything. Is your ult still down? Oh, she ran the safe way. 
I kind of want to go hunter down in the jungle. Should we do that? Hunter down at small camps? Might be getting rat ganked in a sec. He's over by Pyro. Man, I was going to blink that, bro. Like, nice. He actually, he really did learn. He saw an Atlas pole and he did not care one bit. Guy takes so little from him right now. Nice. That was actually a really good Herald. Tilted as she may be. That was an awfully good Herald. Do I need to bother blinking? There's a Scotty here. Scotty, <laughs> Scotty has other priorities though. <laughs> All right, you just dead. Hang on. Come here. Thank you. I will do the speed buff now. <laughs> Scotty had other priorities, man. She just straight up walked straight into that tower. Are you kidding me? I gotta go again. I just popped off too hard. God damn it. All right, well, let's go part two with the Arachne solo. Yes. See, uh, we're not going to get the same team, though. You got to be kidding me. We're not going to have the same spicy chat, are we? Yeah, let's go part two. Let's see what happens. All right, hey, what's up, guys, and welcome back to part two. I'm hoping uh, this game's looking like it might be promising. You guys missed a little bit. Did I troll him? I think he got that. I didn't think they would just straight up, like, insta-delete any of the, uh, the little sides or whatever. Let's make sure that doesn't reset. Okay, that clear was dumb. Um, it also looks like <laughs> that was actually, that might be the wildest clear right there. Triple, was it triple or quadruple or acne web? That might have been quadruple or acne web, because it only keeps three at a time unless they change that. Um, but you can, once they've hatched, you can put down another one and have eight total spiders. Which, speaking of which, oh my god, is he late compared to us? And then, of course, we had the Yorm, too. Wait, are you just eating this? That's what I thought. Bro, the minions are... Okay, wait, why did he... If he has his one, why did he sit there and be all sp super spooked? A little bit of greed, please. Okay, as long as we're not eating the tower shot, it's okay. Yeah, it's too bad. I don't think we're going to do too much there. If Amana has dash and the minions exist, then that's mostly, like, we're just mostly not killing him. But we will try to bully him, and we will see if we can bait this dash at all. Oh... Yeah, it sucks. I can't really spider this right now. I want to be spider. There we go. I want to be spidering him. He's so greedy, man. He's fine. Are you kidding me? These spiders suck, man. Anybody that's ever like max spiders on Arachne, you guys are crazy. You guys are actually crazy. Like he just casually bopped him down real quick. You gotta be kidding me. What's he building here? Oh, he thought he was against a mage. I guess. Yeah, we have Yorm. We have Yorm and Alquang. I'm not surprised. It does make some sense. We actually are weaving in some autos. That's too bad. If I managed to catch the web on him, we could have done some stuff right there. Best that's in mid sword chilling. I wish I had my uh my shard up. Yeah, you don't want this. Bank it up. Alright, I think we double our healing, right? Almost next level, which will be a pretty big deal. So we'll chill just a little bit for now. Looks like Bastet might come hunting for a gank, so I'll keep chilling. Yeah, Vamana is not a very good matchup for Arachne. We are going to um to probably just not kill him ever, assuming he actually goes into the proper defense soon. Oh, that's that's mid again. Um, because he's got the one to just straight up get out of spiders whenever he wants. Like as long as he doesn't use an aggro, he's fine. And then once he gets ultimate, he's just completely chilling in lane. Like I can't ever kill him through his ult unless he's already one HP or something. So we'll see how he plays it. There we go. <laughs> I don't really get a commit, but we get a little something on him. Yeah, I'm trying to not overcommit because I'm assuming Bassett's actually rotating soon. Let's see, can we get any help with the blue buff in a sec? Might end up losing it. I don't know where she's at. I mean, for now we have it. For now it's good. We just good? We might just be good. All right, let's go scoop it up ourselves. Yeah, this is definitely going to be a less exciting lane. We're just against Vamana. Like, he's not even... He doesn't even have the right item. It just doesn't matter. He's Vamana. Oh. Now you're on it. I see. I see. Thank you. Wait, you got to be kidding me. That was like the worst reset we could possibly have. Yeah, our Alquang doesn't really have farm at the moment, so we don't get to do anything. What happened to you, man? That's too bad. I don't know. We, we're Arachne. We have zero secure. I just kind of got to... It is what it is. Alquang maybe gets to secure it there if he plays it different, but we also had a really weird little leash right there. Weird little reset. So we are going to be chilling for a while, trying to get actual money and trying to get our, our gooseberries online. 
And then we probably get to play the game a decent amount. But for now, we're going to be oom um, and not doing damage and not clearing wave. And it's going to be a little bit tough. Because if we ever get opportunities to BVP him, it doesn't matter. He just gets to hit the undo button. And I don't get to contest that totem either. But we'll have to see. If he doesn't build right, we might be fine once we get, um, what do you call it? Once we get amp online. If he if he doesn't just straight up go into like actual fizz D and he wants to be a little greedier. But I'm assuming he will. Hey! You better stop. Vamana, you'd better stop. Hey. Let me do my last hit thing, man. He's going for some bully. I don't think he gets to do anything meaningful. Oh, there is a Bastet gank. Okay. I greeted for my ult. Thank you for the kit. I don't know if this actually heals me. <laughs> Honestly, the auto did a little bit and my heal sucks. So, I don't know if that was even worth hitting. Let's see what last hits we can get. God, it's so rough right now, man. Like, you're telling me I'm getting focused by the cant that I don't get to do anything against. I'm against a baby that I don't get to do anything against. That's so brutal. We gotta just sit here and try not to die a little bit. I'm not even trying to stun him. I'm just trying to clear what I can. I'm assuming we don't get immediately reganked and we can actually push up a little bit, try and get what money I can here. All right, come on, spiders, do your thing. But also, don't take my last hits. Okay, there we go. Boom. We haven't missed too much farm, I don't think. We're down a lot of money. That's just, you know, that's just Arachne clear things versus Vamana clear things. Maybe we get a blue buff in a sec. That'd be neat. That'd be awfully neat. And then if we can actually go super aggro on him as we get back to lane and once we actually get these last couple stacks to go into the auto attack part, we can try and get Gooseberries done. I am going to miss like this whole wave just because we don't have TP though. See, I'm going to greed for the wave, I think. Spiders do the spider thing. You do it? They did it. Nice. Life still should actually be really nice right now, too. All right, so let's see what he comes back with, and let's see if we actually get a fight at all. Because Amp is such a massive power spike. And then maybe we get Alquan ganks soon, too, because he actually kind of caught up in farm a little bit. Yeah, what we what we working with here, baby? Okay, he insta-killed the spiders. Because this god's bad. That's not true. This god's good, but the spiders are bad. Such a bad ability, man. I don't think I even get to do this, right? He just outclears it. He gets this two in a sec. Yeah. Nice. If we can keep getting that auto damage on him, though, that'll be really good. So we actually get a... <laughs> like, right there, if I could gooseberries that wave, it's so different. It's such a different situation to be in. Right now, we got to keep waiting it out. I need to just go straight up failing. So yeah, we never going to play this lane. We have too bad of a matchup. That's unfortunate, man. The whole point of this pick is to try and have fun, but sometimes you get unlucky with it. Sometimes you don't get to have fun until later in the game. I don't think it's any good. Oops, I didn't mean to shard that. <laughs> He's actually, he is actually unkillable, man. He is playing the unkillable god into both of us. Because Alquang's got a bad matchup to it, so easy to baby through execute. And what I what I mean by that is like big baby, as in Vamano, not just like, <laughs> I don't know, not be a baby or whatever, whatever the hell it might sound like. Yeah, it sucks. With Phalanx, he's going to have, how much prod does it get up to? 71, right? I think is the math. Plus HP, plus HP 5. Plus stronger minions. So, we're not going to be really be able to do damage to him for at least quite a while. And then I'm assuming because they got the Bastet Jungle, Vamana Solo, which both do decent damage, we're probably going to need to go Berserker's second item to just not be dying in lane. But what should be nice is as we get a little more into the mid game. Yeah, look at how little damage I do, man. Like, even if he lets me combo him, if he doesn't hold off on the dash, like, it's not even meaningful. But we do work towards Gooseberries, so it's still, like, it still kind of matters. Which, speaking of which... There we go! Look at that! It's beautiful! Hey, I got the clear online! Yeah, we can try and whittle away at him, but it's not gonna be easy. Well, I might get a little Emir gank in a sec. Ooh! Oh. <laughs> He's not dumping anything! Okay. I'll be on my way, man. Yeah, see? It's a big baby button. Oh, you need it, huh? 
I'm assuming Matt Stutt's gonna be there. Our clear is so bad. Well, that's unfortunate. Did we wiggle that? We did, nice. I'm trying to hold the ult here if I can. Are you kidding me, man? Wow, we didn't even need to beads that. I was gonna pre-beads the Herald. Girl just got so deleted, that's ridiculous. Come on, let me hit it! Little CC? Ow. Probably actually enough to stick. Come on, come on, Koomba! One. That's gonna be it, because he got bounced away a little bit. <laughs> there we go. Nice, huge rotations, man. Look at that. Absolutely huge rotations. We sure do get to do things when we're hitting somebody that's not the, the absurdly tanky baby. It really is unfortunate. I feel like some matchups in Nivamana can be like decently fun. He's just so good against somebody like Arachne. So we do have to suffer through the laning phase. But as you can see, like if we get to do something to Hera or uh, maybe even Bassett, Best that's kind of tricky with the whole double jump thing. Plus, cat's dumb. But but anybody like remotely squishy, we definitely still get to do things too. You can frag oh, we don't get the purple part in time. Please kill it. Please kill it. Please. It's just gone. We just lose it. What? I don't know how he scuffed that. <laughs> yeah, I think I could be tripping. I think if Alquang just like kit dumped it. Yikes. I think we just get that and he never gets it. I don't know why he didn't. Cause he got mana, maybe he like, I don't know. Like, did he miss the buff before I got the, I don't know. I feel like he just had stuff. All right, I think we're gonna make sure to level the two. I keep wanting to level the three cause it used to be better to level the three, but it's so good leveling the two now. And you get so like, even with the Arachne buffs, you get so little extra out of leveling the, this. Oh my God, you get an extra spider to also die right away. I really just got, okay. That was so troll. <laughs> that's so, that's so troll. I got bounced into the FG hit, man. All right. I don't think we're doing much anything here. I got a bank really soon anyways. Yeah, I do think we're going to be going that, um, God, my autos are so desync. It's ridiculous. Sometimes they really do just hit that, like, extra level of desync where, like, not only are they just off and it feels bad, but you can't even really tell what's going on. All right, we're going Berserkers. Maybe we'll actually get a Chalice. Yeah, Berserkers into Vamana Bastet, if we actually keep dealing with them. Um, like, I might not really be getting ganked, but I'm assuming we'll be dealing with them a lot in fights. They're going to be people that are good at dealing with Arachne to begin with. So they should be trying to target me a bit. But this should help a lot. We get a lot tankier. We still get decent damage out of the attack speed. If we actually get remotely low, which is going to be pretty common, we get 45% potential attack speed if we proc the passive on Berserkers, which is nutty. Which is absolutely nutty. But anyway, look at the difference in... um. Like, remember I was talking about, like, Mulan playing around minions more, both in terms of clear and also just in terms of positioning? So Mana's done such a different job of it. It's part of why his lane's gone pretty well for him. It's also just a nutty matchup, but, like, I'd still be able to do way more if he was uh, not positioning behind minions and making it hard. We'll shard this, I guess. I don't have my one for it, which sucks. I mean, we finally got it at the end. Oh, it didn't let me ult, man. That sucks. I wanted to ult his one there. That's fine. His ult's way more important than mine. Actually, is it? Sort of. His, his ult's better than mine, but we both we both are probably pretty killable without our ults right now. Maybe maybe in a way mine matters more. I don't know. Depends on who gets ganked. Yeah, he's getting a little little greedy. He's starting to think like now that we have the wave clear online and we're a little past the early game where Vamana just simply like presses a button, the wave dies, um, and he gets down pressure. He's trying to trade a little too hard. Oh, he's got hastened. Oh. Well, I don't know about that, man. Hastened into what? Do I lose tower? I think I lose tower right here. That's okay. I don't think we need this tower. Yeah, you want to do the haste thing? I think I'm okay with it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Let's see if we can get his one here. Oh, alquang has got nothing for this. Never mind. If we get a, if we get a Yorm gank, it's different. Wow, <laughs> that was so buggy, man. That was ridiculously buggy. All right, I'm CCing him for the boys. Gooseberry diff, gooseberry diff. Come on, come on. Nova mana one diff. Nice. 
Yeah, if I get ganked, we're maybe dying without ult. If he gets ganked, he's dying without ult. Let's see if we actually get to get to her. Fine, we can bully Kumba instead. Don't CC me. Excuse me, ma'am. I really want to hold the ult here because it's not looking like this is a... Uh, like we probably don't quite get a kill. So hopefully we can hold on to that and just not be dead whenever we do need the ult. Let's see if I actually get to do this. This is greedy. I think I can big brain it though. Hang on. Okay, a little stun. Nice. And then this. So early. Okay. Well, this might not be as good as I wanted it to be. I might just be giving them pyro. Come on, come on, come on. So easy. It's so easy, man. Get PvE'd. Yeah, if anybody rotated there, that would have been kind of bad. <laughs> I don't think I don't think we would have died because I got ult, but I don't think I'd be able to secure it with the the huge Arachne simply keep auto attacking secure. They just auto attack and hope. Yeah, Yorm wanted, Yorm wanted to cook this game. Yorm wanted to see if gooseberries would work. I was pretty sure it... I was pretty sure it wouldn't. Alright, I think we just do Xe again. And we get our blink going. Xe will be pretty good into the Vamana. Surprised he went um, magic defense already. I don't know, maybe, maybe it makes a lot of sense. Because he shouldn't really be dying to me 1v1. So maybe maybe magic is kind of the only thing that matters because everybody else hitting him right now is going to be magical. Yeah, the hastened was a little early. I've, God, this has 20 power now? High res, come on. Oh, maybe that even makes sense. I'm trying to think. I'm assuming they never... I'm assuming that's what it went to after the power nerf and I just forgot. And that it used to be 25. But that's... Because <laughs> I remember it did used to be 25. In my head, I was assuming that was after the recent power nerf. That's just so ridiculous, man. 20 power on a damage item? You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, they did get the little Vamana rotation. Does this work? It does work. Didn't we learn this last game? I got short-term memory loss. We're not even gonna bomb this tower. It's so free. Look at the team go. Look at them pop off. Tell me they don't have six, man. I do not want to have to go again, because this is not the type of game that I'm going to include for part two unless we actually get to go do things, because it's been boring as hell. We're finally getting to the stage where it's going to not be boring, because I get a not lane versus tank Vamana. Because we get to rotate and stuff. Ooh, actually, hang on, hang on. Yeah, this might be kind of fun. Where we just get a... Well, that wasn't... Eh. eh. <laughs> that wasn't really that fun. Oh my god, Bomb's OP! There was a tower, now there's not. Team is simply clapping too hard, man. Although we have lost everything except Phoenix and Rightland, so maybe ADC's not going quite as hot. I don't know. Maybe that's not looking as good. Alright, do we actually just straight up rotate? I think maybe we just run on over. There's a juicy wave up there, though. Damn, they're so aggro, man, for being this behind. Look at them. They're trying to do terrible things to skip. Stop it! Hey! Oh my god, that's actually five people. This might be a really fat cleanup right here. Hello! Do not CC me. Do not. Okay, we're playing Arachne. Hang on. Busy trying to Penta. Hang on. Oh, it's also OP. This is the Penta Denier right here. This is... Wait, hang on, hang on. We're still we're still rolling with it. She really did stall me so hard just by being Soul. The classic. I always rant about it when we get against a Soul. The Aegis into Aegis combo, man. You think I care? Give me the unofficial Penta. Wait, we actually might. Wait a minute, we might! Man, if we didn't get... If we didn't get so sold... If we didn't get so sold... With 5 second Aegis from the Boring God... That would have been pretty clean. 
That was a pretty clean gank, though. We got in, like, behind everybody and just straight up blinked through the wall. Right into the back line, did arachne things. Uh! Alright, that's a report. That's a ban. That's a ban. Say goodbye to Skipper. Never gonna see him again. I still remember. Was it for a video? It might have been for a video or on stream or something. I still, it's, it's only a vague memory now. But I remember I jokingly said that I was gonna, like, that's a ban or something to somebody at one point in the game. And they took me super serious and they got really scared. And I felt, I felt kind of bad. <laughs> thought it was such an obvious joke. They thought I was gonna, like, streamer privilege into a ban. <laughs> It was it was over something super stupid like that too, man. You don't get to do this. Walk away. No better. I mean, what the hell? That's my pyromancer. You guys, you guys don't have spiders. You don't just get to do that. Excuse me. Oh, maybe we gank a little baby. No, you don't get to go this way either, man. Oh, he didn't. <laughs> I thought I thought he was gonna wrap around. It took so long to get a vision of him on the map. All right, we do arachne things, right? Are you kidding? I'm trying to do arachne things here, man. Oh no, you gotta be hitting that old. Wait, I'm dead. I trolled. Okay, my bad. I thought we'd just be able to auto her down before the two went off. So, whoops. But at least we got the hair relics. That's something. So troll, man. I thought I actually thought she was just dead. I don't know if I didn't get the auto in time or if it got body blocked and we only got the gooseberries damage on her. Or maybe I'm just dumb and, <laughs> and we just didn't have time. I don't know. It's one of those. So close to the level, too. It's been so long since I went Death's Embrace. I want to see how good it is. Because we got a stupid amount of autos and we get crazy cooldown resets, so it might be kind of nutty. And it could get extra nutty if we go malicious, but it's probably not worth. Or segments. Segments might actually be really fun. Ooh. Do we greedily yoink his speed buff behind his back and then zoom into the fight? I think we do. Give me that. Okay, I thought this would be faster. How is our tank speed right now? I have way too- we need Silver Branch. That's where we're going last in this build. We're going Silver Branch. Because if I pop my two, we are overcapping our tank speed by 60% right now. Actually, wait, how good is Silver- is Silver- hmm. Maybe that's not worth it. Because we have, we have to buy attack speed on Silver Branch to overcap. That might just be troll. I don't know. Maybe we go Magic Defense. Let's go like a full-on Onis. Where did the baby go? What? I wanted to gank a baby. I'm trolling. Don't do it. Yeah, if I didn't go gank the baby, we could have just taken the tower there, but that's okay. We didn't need that tower anyways. All right, let's dip. Don't do it. Do not. Nice. Are you? Give me out. Get me out. Get wait, we, we actually might. Hang on. I might have gone too far with this one. If the team doesn't, <laughs> if the team doesn't care enough, that might be it. Yeah, we need we need some cooldown, man. I need to be getting this. Hang on. Oh, she's so far. I shouldn't have too. That was dumb. I was so eager to go kill her. I mean, I want to get somebody killable. Kumba's kind of a dumb target to look for. You gonna do the Vamana thing? Yeah, you're gonna Vamana me into soul so she dies? Yep. To be fair, that's a little, little obscure of a mechanic. Yeah, that's why I didn't go on Kumba before. <laughs> that's why I thought that might happen. I feel bad. I would I would go help, but like tower just dumpsters me if I stay there. And then at that point I kinda have to run. Man, does he actually get through it? Uh, uh I 
almost got a cook. If I got this done on her, that would have been something. Who was it? That sucks. I feel bad. We could have killed Vamana a little faster there. I didn't think, um... I didn't think we got a dumpster him as quick right there. Once I saw Alkwang actually shredding through his ult, I turned back. But I'm assuming either way it would have been the same thing. It was overall, considering how scuffed the fight was to start, they were just kind of dying under mid-tower, outnumbered with no ult. Um, not too bad. Pretty decent cleanup to make it, like, not completely terrible. I'm surprised these guys were down 20 to 5 a second ago and, like, 5k gold. And now they're only down 2k gold, and this game's actually super competitive. Let's see, how much damage do we from... Yeah, we're going magic defense. Yep. And Shogun's is pointless because we already have stupid attack speed, so I'm assuming it's going to be a Noni's. Got our Genjis for the cooldown? That actually might be good. If I start with my two and I go in, the others don't matter that much, but if I proc the two so it goes on cooldown and then I Genjis proc it, I don't know, we, we probably go Oni. I could have gone Amulet of Silence. <laughs> that would have been really fun, actually. Yeah, unfortunately, they got too many boys here right now, and we don't have enough. We got to wait it out a little bit. Bro, I am getting so CC'd, it's ridiculous. I actually don't get to play the game at the moment. We need to group up and get a proper fight. Sucks, I can't really... Uh, I can't really ult in either. God, that sucks. Please tell me she doesn't soul it fast enough. Okay, I think we're good. Come here. No escape. Come here. No. A soul ult's OP, but it's not this OP. Why did you... Every... Stop burning relics when you're dead as hell. Every time, man. I swear, when you get the, when they, you get the absolute freest kills on somebody with their relics up is when they use it. Like, <laughs> no way is she living there, man. That is not happening one bit. Yeah, I'm coming. I'm assuming they just get that. We did save the Phoenix, at least. And it's not EFG. Okay, best that might get greedy? Maybe? Maybe not. Maybe we just do a little pyro. Yeah, we get a little something back. And then... And then maybe we do gold? Cause they you skip her over and left. They think, oh, they're gonna they're gonna kill the Titan. That's what they're doing. Uh-uh. We get the other objectives. God, they really have come back in this game so okay. I, I don't have gooseberries anymore and it's pain now. Yeah, I'm not sure. Like if we get grouped, I don't know if it's even like our our comp is so bad. And their comp is actually pretty good. So it's going to be really rough even if we are fully grouped. Careful, Hang on. I need a purple buff. Sort of. Purple slash orange buff. And a red pot. And they have fire. <laughs> Maybe that's the more important part. We can upgrade this, but it kind of sucks. So we're not going to bother. It's honestly, it's probably better on Arachne than a lot of other people, but it still kind of sucks. I have so much HP with this build. We get so much coincidental health from uh, Death's Embrace and Amp and sort of Onis. I mean, Onis is actually a tank item. But like, if I get green buff, we actually got like 3,100, 3,200 HP, something like that. Just pretty nutty. Or not green buff, but like green totem. Maybe? Come on, minions, stop the back. Minions. Unfortunate. I'd hope. Yeah, it's okay. Okay, maybe I should sell amp. I'm just trying to think, like, we have so much attack speed with our two popped that it's such a waste. Maybe I just get rid of it. And get a straight up tank item and be absurdly tanky. Is it actually good, though? I could go Binding? I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I think this might be Big Brain. Because either the Webs or the Two. Or the Ult. I mean, but the Webs from the Ult. We'll proc it. 
So we still get damage. We do get a decent amount of tank here. They don't know. Oh, they know. Okay, well, we made her whiff. Got through a little bit of stuff. Well, entire Kumba ult's kind of decent amount. Yeah, I'm tanky now. What's up? CC chain him, boys. You gotta be kidding me. Got the auto off in time. Okay, we might die here, but I'm gonna be honest, the build's looking a little OP. Because I have straight up hard carry this entire fight. Yeah, this might be a loss, man. I think our comp's just too bad. I have dumpstered this fight, and it doesn't seem to matter. Like, <laughs> they got so clapped. But, like, we don't have a mage, so we don't really have AoE, and then we don't synergize too well either. And we're really, really single target. Damn, the spider counter to the kit? Please don't. Please don't. I'm dead. Time to get CC'd. Hang on. Little bomb. Yeah. We just lose game here. That's too bad. Alright, you boys. You boys gonna actually end? It should be pretty easy for him. That sucks. That was such a, that's such a lame way to go, too. Because I played that, for, that team fight so well. Got through Kumba ult. Punished the squishies really hard. We should have been able to one-shot the mana, but we got no follow-up. <laughs> We almost killed the squishies again, but then again, we got no follow-up. Tanked a stupid amount of damage. That's too bad, man. But hey, at least we got like a more properly balanced um, Ragni game to, to balance things out a little bit. That helps a bit, right? See how much damage we did. Because in lane, I'm assuming we did almost nothing, but I definitely think we're doing quite a bit late game. GG's. Oh, I got a cape? That's still a thing? Yeah, no, we did, like, a decent amount. It's kind of hard to tell because we did so little in lane. I'm assuming this was a decent amount late game. I'm assuming it was quite a bit, but, yeah, in lane it was kind of just PvE simulator. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you all enjoyed the video, and I will see you all in the next one. I've been seeking for the glory. Say, say, say my name. And I've been trying to wrap my own story in the search for fame I'm sitting here in this empty room, walls keep tumbling down